State health leaders gave an update today on the spreading of adenovirus. Nine children in Alabama have gotten sick with adenovirus and hepatitis since November. The CDC says pediatricians need to alert federal health officials of any new cases. Leaders from the state health department say the best they can do is get the word out. Now we're starting to see some cases that look similar and have similar, potentially similar causes overseas. So we're, we're cautiously optimistic, but we're, we're watching closely. And that's why we want providers to be aware so that they can help report to us any, any adult or child who has uh, these symptoms that, so they could, they could potentially know how to test them so we can, um, so we continue to evaluate. Here's what you should know. Adenovirus symptoms are similar to the common cold, like coughing and sneezing. It spreads through personal contact. To stay safe, health leaders say wash your hands and avoid touching your eyes, nose, and mouth.